Okay, so the other day we found this really cool coffee shop. It's really vintage, hipstery like. So we're hoping to get some really nice portraits there. Hopefully we don't get kicked out. Uh, my plan is to just go there, buy something to eat, and then just wing it. Just try and take some photos. So we'll see how that turns out. We are using the Sony a7 III with the one and only Tamron 28-75 f2.8. We walked in, we ordered our breakfast, and the staff happened to be really nice. So I ended up asking them if it was okay to take some photos, and they were cool with it. For most of these photos, I'm going for a 35 millimeter focal length. That is the focal length that I tend to use a lot of the time and uh, wide open at f2.8 so that I can get a bit of that blurry background. I have my shutter speed set at 1 over 160 so we can get our images pretty sharp. My ISO is set to auto. The reason for that is so that I don't have to worry about it. I know that it's going to be hovering between, I don't know, 50, 300. That's good enough for me. I'm not gonna get a lot of noise and I have my exposure setting set to minus 0.7 of a stop so it's always underexposing a little bit which is okay because I can always bring the exposure back up in post very easily. So Myra wanted this photo where she is drinking coffee and I'm taking it from the outside of the coffee shop through the glass through the window and uh, I know it's a cliche photo and there were some guys making fun of us right behind me so Myra just uh, say hi to them and that's one of the uh, really good things because once you do that people like oh I've been noticed so they stop so yeah that was pretty funny and um, we carried on as normal I've said it before and I'll say it again, that IADO focus from Sony really just makes life a whole lot easier. You don't have to worry about anything. I have to admit, we were a little bit shy at first, especially inside the coffee shop. There were people in there but you tend to notice that people just look at you a couple times and then people don't care. So after a while we were a little bit more comfortable. Myra was more comfortable doing her poses and stuff and everything just had a much better flow to it. A lot of it is making good use of the available light. In this uh, coffee shop, there's a plenty of natural light. In this photo in particular, we were the other way around, so the light was behind Myra, which wasn't great. So we switched up and now the light was hitting her face pretty nicely. So we were getting ready to leave and right before we left we noticed that there was another room uh, part of the coffee shop which was empty. Uh, it was pretty early in the morning so there was no one there and we asked if we could go in to take some photos and the staff very nicely let us go in and we had the whole place to ourselves for a few minutes which was great. That's it for the video, please give it a thumbs up if you liked it and tell me in the comments, do you have this setup? Do you have the a7 III with the Tamron 28-75? Are you looking to get this setup? And is this the way you go out and take photos yourself? Please tell me in the comments, I would love to know.